computer. All right, there we go. We're recording. Just FYI. Keep it PG, ladies. Keep it PG. <laughs> <laughs> happy Cinco de Mayo, everyone. Yay! Happy birthday, Miranda! Oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I was greeted with eggs um, from the omelet maker by my seven, uh, eight and nine-year-old this morning, so had a healthy start to the day. Now I'm clock because it's noon. <laughs> <laughs> and it's your birthday and it's Cinco de Mayo. <laughs> Can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. Oh. Awesome. Well, April was absolutely incredible. So we're going to start a meeting off with some recognition because you guys deserve it. Right? Yeah. It's insane. Like we are tripling what has ever happened in April before and already doing that in May and it's insane. So where should we start girls? And all during being quarantined, right? So I'll go first. So, um, so in April, my organization, we did for QV, we did um, 21,448 QV, which was huge during a quarantine. And we have new to our team in April. I sponsored uh, Brittany, Kim sponsored Jacqueline, I sponsored Lisa, Tracy sponsored James. So we had four new people in April. And then May, in case anybody's on, I sponsor, oh, Chrissy's here. She's new. She joined May 2nd. And Lacey, I'm not too sure if she's on looking at the call. So those are people that are new. And so congrats. Oh, there's Lacey. So congratulations, everybody. And so for Team Murray in um, top QV for April, we have the top three. We have Amy Lento, who had... 2,082 QV. Kim, I think Kim's on. Oh, maybe she's not. She was on. She has 2,033 QV. And Sandra with 1,769 QV. So, and I just want to give a humongous, like, April of 2019, my team did 11,625 QV. So in April of 2020, last month during a quarantine, we went up 121% in sales. That's huge. So congratulations to everybody. And so now if you one of you ladies want to let us know what your teams did, that'd be awesome. Okay. Well, first, I'm not going to go first, but I just want to explain because we have some brand, brand new people. This is their first team meeting. So I just want to explain how we're kind of doing this. So um, Nancy Murray and I became work BFFs a few years ago. We're not on the same Work wives. Team. Yeah, work wives. We're not on the same team. We are under the same umbrella. Like our leader upline is global director Tara Larson, but Nancy and I just work together because finding people in, with Epicure, within Epicure to work with is super helpful. Um, so that's how Nancy and I are connecting. So her teams are on this meeting, her team's on this meeting, my team's on this meeting. And so, yeah, I'm Miranda DeRusso. I'm in Hornpain, Ontario, super far north. Um, and I've got an organization under me. So I just promoted to director. Kaylee is my senior leader and Kaylee's in Sault Ste. Marie. And her leader, Trisha Westerman Beattie, who's also on the call, is also in Sault Ste. Marie. Um, and then Julia Mullins, who is our brand new leader from April, um, is on in Thunder Bay, Ontario. So we're all spread out. Nancy's in Thunder Bay as well. We're spread out around Ontario, um, but our teams are spread out around North America. And that's sort of how we work. And that's why you guys are here. And in case you're wondering, like, who's that person talking? <laughs> that's who we are in our quick intro. Um, but yeah, Kaylee, do you want to do your recognition? Yeah. I'll, uh, I'll go now. So um, like Miranda said, I'm Kaylee Playa. I am from Sault Ste. Marie, Ontario, and I actually promoted last April, April 2019. Um, so basically when I look and I compare based on last year to this year, um, there's been a huge, huge growth. Um, I have a new leader, so Trisha is an, another part of my team as well. So I'm going to do my part of the team, and then I'll talk about our a little bit of about of our organization as well. So um, I had promoted, or sorry, I had sponsored one person last month. So we grew our team by one. 
Um, and we have um, top three in sales would be our third person is Joni Brown with 565 QV, um, Scarlett with 654 QV, and Gwen with 793 QV. So our organization last year, as I said, I was just newly promoted. So we did about 6,000 QV just over. Um, and this year we did almost 20,000 QV as an organization. So we grew by 200 or 320%. Um, which is really cool. You can, base, you can check on your performance based on last year, which is kind of awesome now that you can do that because you can see the growth of your um, performance based on last year. So far this year in May, um, we are up 1400% for our sales in May. So that is crazy. I don't know what's happening in May other than we don't get to leave the house. But everyone is buying and it is the best time to sponsor and to do sales. It's I haven't left this chair and I made twelve hundred dollars in four days. I don't know. It's just awesome. Anyway, it's crazy. Yeah. It, awesome. I, mind blown. I don't ever want to leave this chair again, but just saying. <laughs> my lucky chair. Okay, so Trisha, you want to talk about my leader, Trisha? Let's talk about your team. Sure. Okay. So, um, my organization, um, hold on. Why does it say my video stopped? Can you see me? No. Can you see me now? No, I can't see anybody. The left of, oh, there, there we go. go. Oh, there. Can see you. There you okay. Go. Okay. <clears throat> so, um, my total QV for April, our organization, sorry, was 14,804. And our top in sales was Amy Bowes with 2,328. Um, Menno, um, I guess, with 2,230 QV. And Marika Falardo with uh, 2,196 QV. So, huge. Yeah. Awesome. Huge. Yes. Oh, congrats. Okay. So, it has been insane with the Jerusalem organization also no you cannot make nachos <laughs> oh i love nachos it's cinco de mayo though mom <laughs> no. and it's also yeah no they just had they had <sighs> <laughs> mom will be right with you <laughs> uh, life, people. okay so april 2019 compared to april 2020 was nuts um we had my organization in April 2019, just one year ago, had $21,000 in sales. We tripled that in April 2020 with 63,000 QV. How that's that? amazing. For one month, like that's nuts. Um, and May is shaping up to be the exact same. In May, we had 45, yeah, 45,000 QV. By the end of May, it's May 5th, and we had 36 thousand QV. So pain. Um, but I want to talk about my top three QV for April. So in third place is our brand new leader, Julia Mullins. She had 2,661 QV. Like bonus. Yay, congrats, Julia. Yeah. Um, and Steph Schurman, I think you're here. I saw you. Steph is second place for April sales with 2,830 QV. And drum roll, <laughs> top in QV for April is Chantel Cox. She was in month zero, like joined a week into April and had 3,670 QV. Woo! Hey, hey. <laughs> wow. So that's awesome. crazy. We had so much sponsoring happening in April and that's continuing into May. Um, I'll just tell you my April list of new consultants. I know we have some May consultants here and we'll do that. I'll do that in a little bit but um so we have new consultants darkies leboeuf chantelle cox danielle peltier bruce tripp leanne thompson sam cloutier harmony wesley janice balsley chloe gendron carrie binions carrie dean debbie francoeur and carrie pitkinen all of those um consultants joined our fabulous team in april and yeah like how cool is it that our team is growing people are sponsoring in their fast start which why wouldn't you you get paid lots that way and it's just a great time to grow your team and learn with people show me the money <laughs> yeah um and what's cool about the following list of people is that they sponsored in april 
And now they get to get give the kit for 20% off. So Jasmine Saborin, Janice Elison, Julia Mullins, Nikki Tripp, Chantel Cox, Tanya Isabel. Um, yeah, all six of those ladies get to offer that kit. And all of those new contestants as well that I listed off get to offer that kit at 20% off. So amazing, just awesome. I'm so proud of all of you. Yeah. So awesome. Yeah. Um, I have a couple, can I say this quick and then we'll move on. I have a couple of first time promotions that I want to shout out to. So Chantal Cox, you're getting lots of shout outs today. Yay! Not sorry. <laughs> um, she went from consultant, promoted up to senior consultant, and then to VIP consultant all in her month zero. Woo! That's amazing. And she's on <clears throat> rock star. Yeah, she's on track for executive <laughs> consultant. It's going to happen any day. Um, amazing. So Janice, who sponsored Chantel, she went from consultant, sponsored a few people, three people last month, to senior consultant, VIP consultant, and executive consultant. Boom, boom, boom. Like amazing. Incredible. I know. Um, Barb, you're here. Barb Milwayne went from senior consultant to VIP consultant. That wasn't enough. And then to executive consultant. So well done. And then our leader. So this is what it's all about is getting to leadership and like executive consultant. It goes from executive consultant to leader. And Julia blew that out of the water, promoted to leader. She's already one third of the way into promoting or into qualifying this month, which is amazing too. So congratulations, Julia. So uh, proud of you, Julia. Of you, new leader amongst us. Awesome. Why not get that extra 5% compensation? And can we just give a huge recognition to Miranda, our caring and sharing award recipient who just became director. How amazing. Woo! Congratulations. So proud of you, hon. My work wife. <laughs> Thank you so much. We need a honeymoon soon, Nancy. <laughs> no, totally. It's called Jamaica. Just so you know. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Okay. So with all that being said and done, like we wouldn't have been, yeah, it's just been incredible. Our team growth has been amazing, but we want to keep that momentum going. And it's just, the thing is right now, there's a reason why all these people are joining our teams. And that's because people need this. Like they're at home. A lot of people are out of work. Um, their income has dropped. They need something else to focus on other than homeschooling their children. Oh God, tell me about it. <laughs> So at first, it's easy to tell yourself, well, you know, I just feel guilty doing well with my business right now when so many people aren't, but get past it and realize that we have such an incredible gift to share with people right now and people need it. So now- And in April, I don't know how many people were on the consultants call, but April, the bonuses paid out. Bonuses are, you know, if you do over 2000 in QV in a month, that's if you get a bonus of 3%. If um, you promote, you, there's bonuses we're going to talk about. In April, Epicure is paying out over a million dollars in just bonuses. There was over 70 promotions within the company. You didn't have to wait for somebody to retire. You didn't have to wait for somebody to pass away. You didn't have to, have to wait for anything. You promoted yourselves. Like, it's amazing, right? Over 70 promotions. Incredible. So we are going to talk to you guys about how we're going to help you. Right, Miranda? Yeah. yeah. All right. Um, so Epicure, like we were saying, we have an opportunity to, if you are new, if you started in April or you sponsored in April, you can share that amazing kit for 20% off. As well, if you had somebody on your Epicure team who left your Epicure team for whatever reason, now is the time to reach out to them because typically if you deactivate, you haven't put your third, your order in, in your third month, you stop, you're not an, a consultant anymore. And typically if you want to rejoin, you have to wait 12 full calendar months to rejoin and Epicure has waived that. And I'm so glad they had because there's a lot of people who just didn't have time anymore to do it because they were so busy at work, but our entire world changed. So definitely reach out to those people who in over the past 12 months may have deactivated from your team because they may want to come back and think that it's not even possible. So offering that kit to them is amazing. And even if you don't have the 20% off kit, what if you don't have that option to give someone the 20% off kit guys? Like what can we do? Is it still worth sponsoring? Yeah. 
And too, with the welcome back thing, they can do their fast start and make all those bonuses. So they could have left like two months ago and now they get to start fresh with that new welcome back. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. So it's totally, totally worth sponsoring. <sighs> so do you want to talk about how? How to sponsor? Yeah. How to sponsor. So yeah. it's out. all about... It's all about reaching out. It's all about sharing. That's it. It's just about sharing the opportunity. Like, hey, you know what? I thought about you because simple. Like, just like how we book cooking classes. Like, there was, you know, like Lacey. Is Lacey still on? I'm not sure. Oh, there she is. Yeah. Like, Lacey was talking to me about, um, you know, she loves the product. She wanted to host a class. I'm like, hey, have you ever considered joining? And now there she is. So now she's going to make the commission off of her party that she wanted anyways, right? So why not get more out of it? You know what I mean? Because people, you you never judge a book by its cover, never say, you know, that person, you know, already has a good job, makes a lot of money. There's reasons people want to join. They want to join because they want a community like this. They want, you know, gatherings like this. They might want extra money to put their kids in, you know, dance, whatever, that they just need something extra, right? You never know what somebody's reason is. So just offer it. That's all you have to do, right? Exactly. And one worry, especially when you're new and you're starting out and you're trying to get customers. And I know that a big concern is, well, I'm not, what if I sponsor that person now? I won't have them as a customer. And that's something that we really shouldn't be so focused on because customers can come. Customers are easy to come, but a teammate is much more beneficial to your team. Um, so Leanne Thompson, I know she's going to be watching the recording. She's at work right now, but Leanne Thompson joined the team in April and it was only because she messaged me asking to buy a steamer. She hadn't even thought about joining the team and you know what? I just thought, okay. And I got kind of nervous and a little sweaty before I asked her. That's I'm director and I get nervous and sweaty before I ask people. It doesn't just come easy. It's taking yourself out of your comfort zone. But I asked her and I just said, because I stopped myself. I'm like, Miranda, just don't be this is something you're offering her and you're not just trying to pull her in or, you know, be pushy. So I just said, Leanne, like, I know you shop for me a lot. The steamer comes in the business kit. Um, have you thought about joining? Would, is this something you could see yourself doing? I know within your circle of friends, they're all ordering for me. Like, and she's like, Oh, okay. And she joined because she was going to buy a steamer. So think about that. If someone's asking you for, the steamer or for something else, the prep bowls, or, you know, they have this big long list of products and they're ordering monthly. Think, stop and think about who you could be asking within your clientele, your customers um, to join your team. Cause it's just, it's a different world. Like I said, it's a completely different world. Those people who would have never considered it a month ago are suddenly considering it. So even if a month ago or two months ago, you made your list of people to reach out to make a different list because you're going to have more people on there. Um, and I don't know, guys, do we have any special promotions within our teams for sponsoring this month? What are you guys doing? <laughs> so anyone who joins, who spot, yeah, anyone who sponsors in May, they get swag from me. And from, you know, Julie's doing this as well. And, and anyone in the entire diverse organization will get swag from me when their new consultant puts in their first cooking class in their first month. That first month runs until the end of June. So, yeah. Awesome. So I haven't made my announcement yet, but I asked everybody what they wanted. Ooh, that's <laughs> so that was like my intro. So I put a little post. I said, you know, what would you guys like, like for an incentive? So a lot of them said swag. So guaranteed they're probably going to get some swag. Some said gifts to make or different things like that. So I reached out, but I haven't actually made the announcement yet. So right. you're all hearing it firsthand. Sponsor in May and get that person, your sponsor to do their one cooking class in their first three days and you will get some swag from me as well <laughs> Love it. we just want to see you guys growing your team and that's the reason we share this for you, like for you guys like it's just there's so many benefits and we get so excited like that's what we love about promotions this is what i love about my job is growing leaders and seeing them promote and seeing Succeed. them yes yes exactly yeah did we, did we talk about the bonuses or I had to like go and help my five-year-old? That's okay. Did we talk about all the bonuses that people can get within their first like fast start and non-fast start? We have. Okay. 
So let's talk about that. So um, some of you are really new and haven't got your compensation plan. It is on there. So anyone who is not in their fast start program. Um, so when you promote to executive consultants, you're going to get two. I don't know if there's, I don't think there's any Americans on. So Canadian is $250 US. I mean, Canadian. <laughs> just said that so you're gonna get that a cash bonus so that's pretty awesome so growing your team is gonna help with those cash bonuses that you're gonna get and if you're in your first uh, your fast start program you just have to get to senior consultant and you're gonna get $50 cash you get up to VIP they're gonna give you $150 cash you get up to executive consultant and they double it um, or not double it you get 300 Canadian um, for getting to executive consultant. It's leader. When you get to leader, they've doubled in your fast start. So um, if you're not in your fast start, a leader is going to get $500 cash bonus. If you're in your fast start, six months from joining, they're going to give you $1,000 cash. What would you buy with $1,000? That's a good chunk. That's not talking about commissions you're going to make and all that. But also in your fast start, everybody you sponsor when they do one cooking class they're going to give you what miranda 50 bucks 50 dollars so that's not a talk, talking about you promoting yourself up to senior vip um executive consultant that's just when you sponsor somebody and they do one cooking class in their 30 days that is going to give you 50 dollars cash when you're in your fast start so your fast start is awesome to promote right so take advantage of that and don't leave a bonus on the table. But for us who aren't in our fast start, growing your team is going to help you get those bonuses as well. Plus, do we talk about matching bonuses? I was just going to ask, is there anything what? your new teammates are in their fast start? Right? So when you sponsor someone and they're in their fast start and they promote to senior consultant and they get $50, guess what? You're not in your fast start. But Epi here is going to match that and give you that. So even though you're not in your fast start, you promote someone in their fast start, they get working, you're going to make those cash bonuses. Can you see how you can make extra cash without even like what without your actual regular sales? Yeah, that's pretty cool, right? And we haven't even included your own compensation, like 25. Yeah, your own commission and all that stuff, right? So, and then if you have this um, for the for um, the people who are waiting for their kit, this will come in there. And this is a good guide of how to do things, um, like give you like okay, how many hours you have to put into it. Like if you're doing two to five hours a week, you can you know provide this for your family, such and such, right? So that's a really good guide to go to go to. Um, but also, what what are we all doing? Um, what are we going to do for them on Friday? Did we talk about that? But not too much. I shared just a little bit about that. Um, so we don't want to just tell you, go out and do something and then not support you in how to do that. Um, so yeah, we're doing a Facebook Live and I've set up the event page. I have the link already in our team group, but a business opportunity. So we're going to share with everyone you can think of. You can just add them to the group. There's nothing you really need to do except maybe interact, comment, but we're going to share what comes in the business kit, um, how the fast start works and how much they can take advantage of that. Um, what else are we going to share guys? Just all the perks and why you want to join and yeah. Yeah. And just helping someone. Yeah. Helping someone with their, you know, meal planning, extra income right now. People are bored if they like, some people are bored because they're not working their regular job. So it's a little hobby you could do online because um, online scales have sales have rocketed. Like I, the last month I was over 270% I've jumped up on online sales. So, you know, people are looking for a side gig. So we're just going to share all that with them. And we're going to share our whys, like why we all joined because everybody has a different reason, different purpose for being in this business, right? So we are gonna do a Facebook Live. So you just have to get your people there. And how do you get people there? How would you ask them, Miranda? Yo, yo, yo. Join What's my up? team. <laughs> Join my team. <laughs> you don't wanna just click invite and then leave it at that. Um, I ignore those when that happens to me. I, I do, I just flat out, I don't, 
I just don't think it's personal enough. You, it's just too easy to do. Plus you can end up in Facebook jail and not be able to do anything on Facebook. Um, but what you wanna do is reach out, so write your list first. This event's happening Friday, today's Tuesday. Spend Tuesday, Wednesday, just keep a piece of paper and pen on the counter. When you think of someone, write their name down. Um, and then you can reach out to them and say, hey, my leaders are throwing this information session. There's no pressure, obviously. Just, I've been thinking about you because why don't you check this out? Mm -hmm. And then add them to the group <laughs> or send them the link. And that's pretty much all it takes is just reaching out privately through text, through a call, through messaging. Exactly. And remember, those of you who are Canadians, you can sponsor Americans. And those of you who are Americans can sponsor Canadians. So if you know anybody, like even if you have an aunt in Florida, say, hey, you know, Aunt Mary, I know you have some friends that are looking for a little side gig right now. Can you like let them know that this is happening and, you know, reach out to their, their those little groups, right? Because you never know. Like, because a lot of people in America still don't know who we are, let alone Canada. Like, 80% of Canadians don't even know what about Epicure. So there's lots of growth still in Canada. Mm -hmm. So just reach out to everybody you know, because you don't know who might need us right now. Yeah. I know a lot of us have hosts right now because May is crazy. Everyone loves the new catalog. And through our booking blitz, I can see that people have lots of hosts. Um, I ask every single one of my hosts if, you know, you ooh, this was really successful. I think your family and friends would really support you. Yeah. Um, yeah, I know we were talking about inviting people to the business opportunity and you could still turn it, ask your host to join you there. But just in general, just as another idea of who you could be growing your team, like what kind of people you could be having on your team, but asking hosts is really, really helpful. Does anyone have any questions? I know that we just threw a lot of info at you, especially with the money from the fast start and all that. That's all that all can be found on Epicure University under the new consultant tab, as well as your compensation plan book that came in your kit. But does anybody have any questions, any concerns, um, anything at all that you want to ask? Don't be shy. You can even comment in the chat box if you're too shy to talk. Mm -hmm. One more option that I want to say, I don't want to let this meeting end and not give this because I know all of us, whether it's Trisha, Julia, Kaylee, Nancy or I, um, we can help you in another amazing way. You may have people who are asking you questions about the business opportunity. Um, and once that conversation gets going, I know that can be scary. You don't know how to answer their questions. What has really helped, and a few people have joined the team this way, is start a three-way conversation with your leader with, and that interested person. and Just introduce them. Say, hey, Suzanne, this is um, Nancy, my leader. Um, she's here to help answer any questions that you have since I'm new or since I've never done this before and we can work together and she's always here to support you and start a conversation that way. Um, and then the pressure's off you. We don't want this on you feeling like this is stressful, so. Yeah, for sure. Cause sometimes, yeah, you just don't know how to answer certain questions. So. Hey awesome. ladies, can I share? Yeah. Is it okay if I share? Okay. I am sorry if my network is a little bogged down. I have twin 13 year olds that are doing school and my husband's a vice principal trying to work right now. So <laughs> um, I just wanted to say though, that I think a lot of what holds people back from team building is this thought that they have to be this magnificent leader. And um, I think that I mean, I know I'm brand new to this and I don't really know a lot of you at all, but um, I have experience in other home sales. And what I have to say is that we judge ourselves so harshly a lot of the time that we, we hold ourselves back. And so this could be something you guys have shared before and I just don't know because I haven't been here. Um, but I remember one, a, a meeting years ago that I went to where somebody did the analogy of, we were actually sitting in a restaurant and somebody had a, ta a, a tray of desserts and they went around and they offered it to like four people in the room instead of offering dessert to every single person in the room. And, and then they said, if your waitress actually, or waiter actually did that to you when you were in a restaurant and they looked at you and judged you and went, mm, she don't need dessert, then 
you would be like, what is wrong with me? Why don't I get dessert? Right? So I think when, first of all, you realize you don't have to be an awesome leader, this Epicure business is so easily set out. Anyone can walk in and start sharing and somehow magnificently do well. And I see that my connection is unstable, so I don't know if you're I good. froze. Um, no, but it, it's not because I'm a superstar. It's because I don't judge who I'm offering it to or who's coming to me and saying something like, oh, my business just isn't doing well right now. Oh, really? You need a side gig? Like, just whatever, whoever you happen to be talking to, offer them dessert. Just, just say it because chances are they're racking their brains in these times trying to figure out how they're going to make ends meet. Or maybe it's not about the money at all. Maybe it's just they're so stressed they just want some kind of happy place where they don't have to be serious. And so maybe this is their little bit of happy time that they get to connect with somebody and it's not about what their test results were or what, like, you just don't know what yeah. people need this for. So that's my so true. little tip today. Offer everyone dessert. <laughs> and even like at conference, I know I've talked to so many people at conference where this was their second career because they were, they were nurses that were just burnt out and just needed out and they got into Epicure just for a less stressful job, right? So you never, never know who needs it and never judge a book by its cover mm -hmm. and offer everybody dessert, share the dessert. I love that. That is such a good like vision right yeah it kind of ties in a little bit with something that i learned a while ago and it's still hard to do um is always have i call it a chicken list so it's like human nature when you're looking at who to sponsor or who to reach out to it's human nature not to ask people who you see as above yourself because mm -hmm. you're intimidated and you're scared and you think well they would never want something i'm doing have a chicken list write out a list of who you would love to have on your team but you're too afraid to ask and just take one a day and talk to them <laughs> because you'll be really surprised. Like we see ourselves below where we actually are and we put others above us, like Chantel was saying, and yeah, have that chicken list out. Love it. Love it. <laughs> bark, bark. <laughs> oh my God. That was awesome. Oh, Kim has a question. Oh, wait. oh, you're on, you're on mute. Okay. There we go. Okay. okay. So I just wanted to say, cause I don't know a lot of you guys either, but, um, the few I do know, know that I have been in direct sales for a really long time, um, just with different companies and whatever. And I just had to really come back to Epicure because this is me. This is my life. This is what I represent in my life. Right. So it's become really, really easy for me to go through my fast start and I'm just hitting the goals like boom, 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 put the cookie in front of me and I'm grabbing it, right? So I just have to say that it's come from a lot of experience too. And even like what Chantel was saying is like, you know, not judging people, going out there, offering it to every single person and just, you know what, even the guys, I mean, I would die to have a male on my team. Like, oh, we, we got a, we got a male in the house. I know Jay. I do. I know. <laughs> <laughs> As soon as I saw that, I'm like, way to go. Like, yeah, that's awesome. Oh my God, that is the best thing because you know how it goes, right? Any woman would buy off of a man. And you know what? If that man's good looking, damn it, I'm spending twice as much, right? <laughs> so, you know what? That's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a man on my team because, I mean, those are the ones that are going to go out there and they're going to be like, buying stuff and selling stuff and they're going to be like right in there. So those are the people that I'm looking for and I'm not going to like bring myself back down to that level that I can't do this anymore because I can do this and I am mm -hmm. doing this and everybody can do it. And it's just the passion and getting outside of your little box and going, you know what? It's okay. Scariness, fear causes the same thing in your body as excitement does. So why not pick, right? Your body's yep, so true. Things. So pick 
pick that fear and grab it by the bullhorns and ride that fear. So awesome. And I'm so proud of you, Kim. Kim's first month ends in May and she's already done five cooking classes and sponsored her first person. So awesome. Oh. Good job, girl. I just closed, I just closed my eighth party today. Oh, there you go. Ooh. Look at that. So you earned your kit money back. I love it. <laughs> awesome. So yeah, so reach out to anybody. If you want us on your calls, like a Facebook, um, three way to help you answer, help you answer questions on anybody that wants to sponsor, but just reach out, make your list, um, and just invite them to the event. Um, I'm going to repost ours and, um, so yeah, so we can share with them and help you grow your business. Okay. And don't be scared of becoming leader. Like Julia, you know, she's a brand new leader and we all work together. So you're not going to be alone. If you hit leader and you're scared to hit leader because you're like, oh my God, it's so much work. I have to like run a whole team. We do everything together. Mm -hmm. So it's so mm -hmm. easy. It's so fun. Like I love working with these girls. Like it is so much fun. Like we have coffee mornings and just like, you know, shooting the shit about what we're going to do. And I love it. I love it. So never be scared to promote yourself because of if you think anything's more work, the, the more we work together and the more people that we have working with us, the better it is. Right. Mm -hmm. So don't be scared. Of I was going to say that. Yeah. Like even about the fast start program, I'm getting people who I think might be good at doing this business but are maybe scared of the amount of work to just join the mega class just to be in the mega class not even to necessarily participate but just to see how good the leadership is in helping people because seriously you think about it mm -hmm. all through this month we have four mega classes happening one a week and you can just be adding keep adding your host to that and not really doing much work besides handing out a shopping link Mm -hmm. like that can get you through your fast start all on its own so yeah. why wouldn't you take advantage of that why wouldn't you say to somebody hey you know how you got laid off and you don't know if your job's going to be there after covid why don't you just give this a try in the meantime and and earn your kit money back because you could do two classes a week no problem because mm -hmm. you're not doing the work right exactly. like really so, um, yeah, I just thought I'd give a shout out to Melinda, who's on the call here, because she's, she just bought her kit on the first, and she has four shows happening already, some of them in the mega class, and Whoa! Janet has some shows going on too. She just started, like, I don't know, not even two weeks ago, um, and I'm just so proud of each of them. And then my third gal, she's busy closing shows right now, so that's why she She's not on there, but um, thank you guys for all you're doing as leaders to support this for all us new peoples. <laughs> yeah, Melinda. Okay. Uh, and Thanks. you know what? <laughs> when you become a leader, you're gonna we're gonna all work together too, right? Yeah. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Hands up if you're gonna be a leader. Quit hijacking the call now. Bye. Who wants to be a leader? Who wants to be a leader? Right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> woo, woo. Get all the new stuff for free. I think that's like my favorite perk. <laughs> Besides helping everybody else grow, but getting all the new stuff. Oh my God. That's like awesome. <laughs> now I know this is Nancy did. Just with leader, you get that? Sorry. All the new stuff. When oh. you become leader, every time there's a new catalog, we get all the new stuff for free before it launches. So we can pr try it and taste it uh -huh. and all that stuff. So it's so, it's such a good bonus. <laughs> it's a good perk. Um, now I know Nancy for her team has and is doing something a little bit different for people who are interested in promoting to leader. Um, Kaylee and I have starting tomorrow, tomorrow we have a meeting at 2 p.m. The Zoom link is in my team group, but I can send it to you. Um, and we, it's for anyone who wants to just grow a little bit more in their business, whether that's promoting, whether that's more QB, it doesn't matter. Any kind uh -huh. of growth, if you wanna see it, come to the meeting tomorrow at two. We're just gonna break down, tomorrow's gonna to be breaking down goals and breaking down the career plan, which I know can seem overwhelming and helping you figure out what your goals are. And after that, we'll do little mini breakout calls, sessions, whatever you guys need to support you, we'll make it happen, but tomorrow at 2 p.m. Awesome. Yeah, there's so much in place, guys. Like, yeah, we wanna help you. Yeah, so much in, pl in place for everybody's success, right? So awesome. Yeah. Does anybody have any other questions? 
No. No. Okay. Okay. Well, well, I guess that's it. <laughs> We're going to continue the meeting. I'm going to hop on to my team group and do a little special draw there. So come on over to Team DeRusso right now. And this recording will be up in our groups, all of our groups, very soon, depending on horn paint internet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Awesome, everybody. Have a wonderful day. Amazing. Bye. 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 <laughs>